It is 735 on your Wednesday morning. Welcome back to Good Day Savannah. So this Sunday, a very special Sunday for the Haitian community here in Savannah. Out in Franklin Square, our Haitian community will celebrate Haitian Flag Day. It's a chance for those with similar backgrounds to come together, remember their homeland, and how far they've come here in the States. Joining me this morning to tell us all about it, Chris Monperus and Belinda Baptiste, owner of Unforgettable Bakery. Now guys, this is going to be quite the party. Tell me all about it. And we intend it to be a large, large party. <laughs> and this is the fourth year that um, we uh, are having uh, the flag day, Haitian flag day, if you will. And Chris has put it on like for the last four years. And then Unforgettable has decided to join with them and to make it a big event. And so we're going to have a party. We'll have the Haitian music. We'll have the cooking. <laughs> we'll, have, we'll have dances. We'll have... Uh, you know, we're inviting everybody from everywhere. All the communities just come and join us. Fantastic. And celebrate with us. Chris, you are president of the Haitian Flag Day celebration here in Savannah. One thing I didn't realize is how big a deal the Haitian soldiers were for Savannah all the way back then. Kind of explain for me uh, the Haitian monument, everything. Well, and um, many years ago, in October 9, um, 1779, the uh, 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 1,500 soldiers left Haiti and come here to help end the American Revolutionary War. And um, because of that, many of our government people here in Savannah, they got together. Yes. And then they decided to um, erect the monument to recognize them. It's huge. It's a huge monument. It's a big deal all over the world. And trust me, I hear a lot about it. So I decided, you know what? Why not do something for the city? Why not say thank you to the guys that actually bring this history back to life? So I decided, hey, let's bring Haitian Flag Day. Awesome. And now it's, we are on our fourth year. Show me that gorgeous flag, guys, if we can come back to camera. Oh, yes. <laughs> Proud of it. That is the Haitian flag. <laughs> that is, a Haitian that is flag. the centerpiece, I guess you would say, of the celebration this coming Sunday. Now, again, it starts at. It started. At, uh, well, I will be out there from eight in the morning, eight but we are we are going all the way through midnight. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And again, that incredible food, lots of dancing, lots of music, lots of that. And so come on and join and us enjoy and with celebrate us. with us <laughs> and have know? fun with us. We are very proud Haitian, and we want to show the community, you know, how we celebrate. And you're Savannah Haitian. Yes, Savannah we are. Haitian. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> with That's the history and all. With the history and all. Now take Absolutely. a look at the screen right there. Sunday, May 18th. It celebrations. We've got it listed as 1:30, but it's actually yeah. an all-day long well, celebration. Right? Yes, we will honor. We will start honoring our honorees at 1:30. Okay, but, but the, the party is all day long. All day long. Okay. Yes. You can find more information at wjcl.com or at savannahaitianflagday.com. I'll have that link posted in our website wjcl.com. Chris. Belinda, thank you so much for being with us. Thank, thank you for, you for having us. us. Glad thank to have you. you. It's going to be a great event out there on Sunday. Thank you. All right, well, still to come, Alec Baldwin, he's arrested again. We'll tell you what he's saying about the city's police force after he was taken in custody.